men in black gunmen were regime police. January 2, 2014. It is now confirmed that black clad gunmen seen atop the Labor Ministry building on December 26, 2013 during deadly violence last month that left two dead were in fact police. National Police Office Commissioner this morning admitted that the men in black on the rooftop of the Labor Ministry's building near the Thai Japan Youth Center in Dindang are police. The National Police Commissioner's official admittance came as he led senior police officers to deliver best wishes and receive New Year blessings from the President of the Privy Council General Prem Tinsuland this morning. Police General Ajul admitted that men in black are police and vowed to investigate and bring them to justice procedure. He also admitted that the men in anti-riot uniforms who were seen smashing the windshields of a vehicle of a volunteer nurse are also the police. This admission is particularly important, because the death of fallen police sergeant Major Narong Batizat that day was caused by a bullet fired not from the streets where protesters were, but from the rooftops where those men in black were positioned. Forensic police confirmed that ballistic tests showed that the dead policeman, Narong Batizat, was shot from a high ground. Now that it is confirmed that these gunmen were in fact deployed by the regime, as all evidence had suggested, the blame for deaths caused by these gunmen must be appropriately shifted to the regime itself.